Hey everyone, happy Thursday, which is really like our Friday this week because spring break starts tomorrow. So how cool is that? All right. Um, I hope you guys have had a wonderful week. I hope you were able to get outside some and play and all that fun stuff. So right now we are going to do just a quick subtraction review. And remember with subtraction, we have our minus sign and he tells us that we are going to be taking away, okay? And today the strategy that we're gonna work with is using manipulatives. Manipulatives, can't talk today. Um, now, I don't have our red and yellow chips at my house that we use at school, and I don't have my bears or our connecting cubes or anything like that at the house. So what I'm going to use are these, Hershey Kisses, all right? And my husband loves them, so we always have them at the house. And they are great to use because I can physically pick them up and I can move them, which is what helps us with our subtraction. So you can use anything at your house that you can physically pick up and move, all right? I used markers the other day. So if you have markers at your house, you can use them. You can use crayons, pencils, Cheerios, Fruit Loops, whatever you have that you can physically pick up and move, that will help you, okay? So we're just gonna do a quick subtraction review working with manipulatives and how they can help us solve, all right? So let's read our first equation. Five minus one equals what, all right? So we have to solve what five minus one is. Five is our bigger number. So I'm going to put out one, two, three, four, five Hershey Kisses. Okay, so I have five, right? So there's our minus sign, and he tells us that we are gonna be taking away how many? One, so watch, I'm going to physically move it. It is not there anymore. So let's count to see how many Hershey Kisses I have left. One two, three, four. So what does five minus one equal? Four, because I have four Hershey Kisses left. All right, let's do another one. All right, read my equation with me. Eight minus zero equals what? All right, so Eight is my bigger number. So how many Hershey Kisses am I going to put out? Eight. So here's my one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. So I have my eight Hershey Kisses, okay? There's our minus sign, eight minus. He's telling me to take away how many Hershey Kisses? Zero. So am I going to move any of my Hershey Kisses? No, I am not. So I haven't moved any. So how many do I have left? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I still have, whoop, eight Hershey Kisses. So let's read our equation, eight minus zero equals eight, because I did not have to take away any of my Hershey Kisses, okay? Ooh, let's read it, ready? Two minus two equals blank, okay? So my first tell, number tells me how many Hershey Kisses to put out, and it tells me that I'm putting out how many? Two. So one, two, okay, minus, that tells me how many to take away, two. So I'm taking away how many? Two, so one, two. How many Hershey Kisses do I have left? Zero. Right, so let's read our equation. Two minus two, equals zero. I took them all away. All right. 
And last one that we are going to do, let's read our equation. Nine minus six equals blank. I need to solve what nine minus six equals. My first number tells me how many Hershey Kisses to put out. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. I have out my nine Hershey Kisses. Minus, that tells me how many to take away. How many am I taking away? I'm going to take away six, all right? So count with me as I take away six. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, so let's count to see how many Hershey Kisses I still have left. One, two, three. So what does nine minus six equal? Three, let's read our equation. 9 minus 6 equals 3. All right, so that was just a quick review of what subtraction is and how you can use manipulatives at your house. And remember, you can use anything, right? I use Hershey, Hershey Kisses. I've used markers, all right? So you can be creative and you can pick any type of manipulative that you would like in your house and you can use it. All right, guys, so I hope this was helpful and a good re review for you guys. And I say this at the end of all of my videos, but remember to do what? Count to 100 by ones and by tens. And I hope you all have a wonderful and safe spring break. And I will see you guys when we come back to school on, I think it's April 20th is when we'll be back. Let me check. Yep, April 20th, that Monday. So I will see you then and ready to move on with some more subtraction. All right, bye guys.